only but pray for the well-being of Hyderabad's heritage. I, I think Ghalib, it was to say, Dibne Maryam, Hua Kare Koi, Mere Dukh Ki Dawa Kare Koi, Tum Harek Ko Chahi Hai Ki Wo Dua Kare, Ki Jo Kuch Hyderabad Ka Ki Virasat Bachi Hai, Wo Baakhi Rahe. The Indian National Trust for Art and Cultural Heritage, Intak Hyderabad Chapter confers the Intak Heritage Award 2015 on Garrison Wesley Church. The Garrison Wesley Church is located in the Lal Bazar area of Trimangiri. The church is one among an ensemble of buildings and cemeteries that served the British state and stationed at Sikandrabad following the subsidiary alliance with the Nizam of Hyderabad. The foundation of the church was laid in 1853 and the structure was completed in 1881 at the initiative of Reverend William Burgess, who moved to Sikandarabad from Madras in 1878. The Garrison Wesley Church is a fine specimen of carpenter Gothic architecture, which gained immediate immense popularity in the late 19th century, especially for construction of small churches. The style is notable for its relatively un unembellished surfaces, prefit of profuse ornamentation, which is a hallmark of monumental Gothic buildings. The architecture of the Wesley Church relies on the use of basic Gothic elements such as pointed arches, flying buttresses, steep gables, and towers to lend grace and majesty to the otherwise unadorned structure. Other structures forming the ensemble are equally impressive and include the haven, the parsonage, ceremonial gateways of the two cemeteries attached to the churches. church. There are numerous finely crafted tombstones and memorials, including a few which are designated as Commonwealth War Graves, indicating that some of those martyred in the two great wars are interred here. Within the church itself, one finds a brass plaque which records the tragic death of the wife and son of Reverend Burgess, who were wrecked off the coast of Portugal in 1892. It is said that their luggage included the church bell, which had been cast in England. The belfry of the Garrison Wesley Church has remained without a bell ever since. The church was restored with the use of traditional materials by professionals qualified in conservation of heritage structures and rededicated on 21st December 2014. The painstaking effort in ensuring authentic restoration of this prime example of classical European architecture bears testimony to the sensitivity of its custodians towards the need to preserve our heritage. For its meticulous restoration, the Garrison Wesley Church richly deserves to be acknowledged with an award. I request Reverend Mrs. M. Jyoti John Sundar, the writer in charge of